Hello everyone, this is Kerry Anderson. Hope you all doing well. In today's video, I'll be talking about seven foods you should never eat if you want a flat stomach red meat. So that's all. Um, um, like if you like the video related to total health, I would like to request you all please do subscribe to the channel, hit the bell icon, and give thumbs up so that I will come up with more and more videos with lots and lots of information. So yeah, be big and let's go. Seven foods you should never eat if you want a flat stomach red meat the first one you may have totally good intentions of trying to boost your protein intake and keep your diet low carb but if you are getting your protein from the wrong sources it could actually backfire and cause you to gain belly fat try to stick to lean proteins like fish chicken and turkey and stay away from fatty cuts of red meat the second one, sugar. Sugar has plenty of negative effects on your body, so it's really no surprise that is also being linked to excess belly fat. Avoiding sugar forever is obviously going to be difficult. You gotta treat yourself every now and then, but try to limit the amount you consume on a daily basis and watch out for sugar in unexpected places like yogurt, juice, and coffee drinks. Then the third one, alcohol. Though red wine does have health benefit, unfortunately, calories from alcohol are partially stored as belly fat. So like all good things, moderation. Then it comes to packaged food. You prob probably know that uh, packaged processed food are bad for you because of the high amount of sodium and sugar they contain. But there's another reason to avoid them. They often contain added trans fat. Trans fat help extend the shelf life of food, but they also cause inflammation and excess belly fat. Then it comes to refined carb. You don't have to go low carb to be healthy, but you do have to choose the right carb. Refined carb that are low in fiber and nutritional value have been shown to increase belly fat while um, high fiber whole grains can actually reduce it. Then it comes to cheese. There's no love greater than our love for all things cheesy, but because it can contain saturated fat, eating too much of it can definitely show up in the place you least want it to, to your stomach. But since a life without cheese is just um, not one worth living, eating a moderation and offset cravings will heal the fat found in salmon, oil, and walnut. Then it comes to milk and dairy. Whether or not you were born lactose intolerant as we age, many people begin to have difficulty digesting the lactose in uh, dairy products, which can then upset our digestion, aggravate our stomach, and cause chronic gas and bloating. In addition, full fat dairy products can also lead to belly fat when eaten in excess that's all about the fitness in this video i hope you all liked it i'll definitely come in the next video with my other content till then um, take care of yourself goodbye take care